हेलो एवरीवन सो वेलकम टू एआई इन्फ्लुएंसर कोर्स बाय क्वांटा एआई लैब सो इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी टॉक अबाउट हाउ यू जन हाउ यू क्रिएट अ सिंगल इमेज हाउ यू क्रिएट अ सिंगल इमेज फेस ऑफ द मॉडल देन हाउ यू कैन क्रिएट मल्टीपल इमेजेस ऑफ सेम फेस एंड जनरेट अ लोअर आउट ऑफ इट ओके सो इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी यूज हाउ यू कैन जनरेट इमेजेस आफ्टर लोरा क्रिएशन ओके now let's add control to our images for example the pose and all the things for example let's take take about this girl this girl pose is like this okay so for this to giving controls to any image with our lora we required what we required control nets okay then the control nets comes into the picture so if we see there are a lot of control nets here so can e pose and depth anything or like this so let me show you this thing flux control net ishiga is the one okay there are a lot of control nets there are xlab control nets also but we are looking for the shaker this one we are looking for which is recently the 2 pro okay let's uh, let's take this one so this is the smooth edges workflow this is canny this is open pose and this is depth and this is gray okay so you can read this also from here this is include canny soft edge depth pose gray so these are the control nets they are providing with this mod and here is the model you can download the model from here directly and where you need to place it just go to the comfy ui uh let me take you to the go to comfy ui go to models folder then we can search for the control net or you can place it here or in the flux making any directory or something like that so for example let's take me here let me paste here let me rename it uh rename it the sugar okay so this we give now we change the name and it's done so we place the control net here but you need to place it in control net anywhere you can make a folder like this or you can place it here also that's not an issue so let's refresh this one okay so how we make this workflow first we load diffusion model which we already seen in the previous video the clips load lora then we give clips to this positive and the negative one we don't write anything in negative because flux didn't support the negative and then here we give in the note we provide all the necessary details with the co uh, control net this is apply control net from here we give the controls okay so here we give the control net from the here we'll load the model so this is for the loading control net so from here we see flux one checkered fusion so we are using this one set union type so if you want to select open pose you can select open pose depth anything it like we a is same what we are giving for the previous video now for example let's use open pose so this is the pre processors we required to pre process the image like this okay so there are a lot of things just like open pose pre processor and dwp processor is also for the open pose only depth is also depth anything pre processor zoe depth anything pre processor these are the different different types of pre processors so for open pose we are using dwp pre processor i provide all the details here also so in the workflow where you uh, you get this workflow in the pre, on my patreon channel you can uh, go and join that patreon and get this workflow so from here we see dw pose for pose control net dw poser we already select then control net condition 0.9 and uh, control guidance 0.61 okay 
so 0.9 strength and the end percentage 0.65 what that means strength means we how much control we want to give to the control nut so strength is more means more control to the image okay starting and ending when you want to add control nut model for example the process is 100% then 65% of the process done with control nut and the remaining 35% process is mainly on the model generation okay uh, let me run this one quickly so it will move it like this so we give immediate here then it takes the pose here dw poser if you see this one and we get the size and we empty latent we take the size from this one this image only so we get the correct image here okay we provide lila image also lila uh, lora also for getting our character image and then we go to the k sampler and get the image k sampler model latent we are giving and all the things here this is positive negative and we are doing like this okay let me add some prompt here so i use chat gpt for the prompt but don't confident okay this is the pose we can use this one for the next generation okay so we are using this one okay so it changes let's rerun it that's why we need to run one more than one time so that's the major thing pose is this one and it is taking like this it takes the pose correctly but it didn't interpret the things like this sometimes it gives this uh, the generation like this okay so we got the similar type of image here with lila face so let's do one more thing here let's use the depth anything preprocessor and generate this one so it takes the depth and now we will generate the image So as we see we got the image here again according to the prompt and according to the LoRa. So if you see if you see there is uh, the difference in the face you can increase the strength of the LoRa. So you can put it 1.1 something like that and regenerate it again. Then you see much more similar images. So you can increase the strength of LoRa, you will get the images like 1.1 and 1.2 something like that. So all the models and all the things I provided in this note you can download it. And mostly already we have the Flux A, VA and all the things. Hope you like this video, if you like the video subscribe our channel for the next video and get the notification. Thank you everyone.